Hey everyone, it's the Roger Williams Media Minute. Today I want to talk with you about online video delivery. So video on the internet is basically a foregone conclusion at this point. I remember 13 years ago when people were like, there'll never be enough bandwidth, the videos are gonna suck, they're gonna be too small, no one's gonna use it. Well, here we are, you're watching this video right now, and online video is here to stay, it's very effective, uh, as a business owner, you need to be doing video. It's just that simple. Now, the question is, once you've made this video, where do you put it on the internet so that people can go and see it? Well, there's a lot of different ways you can do this. You can self-host it. So you can take that movie file, you can put it on your web server, and you can set it up on your website so that people can watch it. And basically, they're downloading it from there. Every time they watch a video or look at your website, they're downloading that information. The problem with this is that video files are huge. So you got text files that are like that big, you got image files if they're optimized, you know, smaller or better. But video files, if you're doing HD video, it's huge. Okay, you're talking about a gigabyte for an HD quality video at I think 10 minutes or so. So that's a huge amount of bandwidth. A, that you, you know, the customer needs to download, and then B, you've got to deliver it. And most web hosts, only allow you a certain amount of data per month before they start charging you more for it. So, what do you do? Well, you should find a third-party website to host your videos on and deliver this stuff. There's a few of them out there. There used to be a lot more. Basically, it really comes down to one major player right now, and that's YouTube. You want to put the videos onto YouTube. Why? A, it's free. So, once again, there's no cost associated to it. You put it on there, and B, it's the third most trafficked website on the internet. Last month, they finally hit a benchmark. They went over a billion views in a month. There's only two other websites that do that. It's Google and it's Facebook. Now, Google owns YouTube. So the other reason you want to be on YouTube is that YouTube videos show up in the search results on Google. So if someone does a search for something that has to do with whatever video you made, there's a chance that that video is going to show up in those organic results. You want that. You want to be there. There's just no question about it. So you go to YouTube. You set up your channel there. You put your videos on there. You add your images. You get everything kind of tweaked out and just start using it. There's a lot more depth to go into it. There's tags, there's descriptions, there's adding links in your descriptions. Um, and all of that I'll do in other videos. But for right now, you really just need to go set up the account, start uploading your videos, and start interacting with other people that do videos on there. My email's right here. Comments are down below. Let me know what you think. As a business, you need to be getting onto YouTube. That's what I got today. Tomorrow's another day. Till then, rock on.